There are two recipients for the MAC Rookie of the Year. Our first winner led our team in scoring during an inaugural campaign with four goals and three assists for 11 points. From Iona, Gabby Diego. Our second recipient finished tied for fourth place on the max scoring list during the regular season with nine goals and four assists for 22 points. From Siena, Caitlin Cajala. The 2009 MAC Defensive Player of the Year is a senior goalkeeper that owned a league best 0.81 goals against average during the regular season and led the conference in shutouts with nine to her credit. From Loyola, Brittany Henderson. Offensive Player of the Year, recorded six goals and three assists for 15 points during the regular season, placing her in a tie for 10th place in the max scoring chart. From Loyola, Teresa Farina. And last but not least, the 2009 Anaconda Sports Back Coach of the Year has led her team to an overall record of 13-4-3, including a 9-0 mark in the MAC, en route to earning the top seed in the 2009 MAC Women's Soccer Championship. From Loyola, Catherine Vittori. Thank you very much. This is a tremendous honor. Um, thank you to the MAC and to Disney uh, for this wonderful event. Um, I'm very blessed to have this opportunity at Loyola. Um, I work with a fabulous administration who's extremely supportive. Um, I have wonderful assistants um, who make my life uh, so much easier day to day and do great things. Um, and I have a team of players that work very hard. Um, all these people have, have touched my life tremendously. Um, and this is made up of the contributions of many people. Um, this is bigger than just an individual. So thank you very much for this great honor. Congratulations to all of our award winners. I'd like to invite Rich Enzer, Commissioner of the MAC, to come back to the podium for a few closing remarks. 
about the great job Katie's done in her first year out. Thank you, Katie. I want to thank the entire MAC staff for their hard work, and uh, I won't go through the list, but they've all contributed in a significant way to the uh, success of the event to date, and we hope to a great conclusion on Monday afternoon. I want to welcome you again on behalf of the MAC Council of Presidents and the MAC Committee on Athletic Administration to the Walt Disney World and our annual championship here. Uh, we have a number of the presidents with us today, and uh, we had a board meeting on Friday with the presidents. And without their support, uh, this event wouldn't take place, and the support of the athletic administrators. So I want to thank them, uh, and I think we all should. One little announcement, I, I do want to note that on Friday we had before us an extension of our agreement with Disney Sports and it was approved by the council after uh, the athletic administrators had looked at it on Monday and approved it as well. So we will now be going through to the uh, spring of 2015 with the uh, fall championship here at Disney as well as moving back uh, after a two-year absence our men's and women's golf championship to the Magnolia and Palm courses. And we're very pleased uh, to have that continued relationship with Walt Disney World. Some uh, 11 years back, we uh, thought that this would be an opportunity to have a championship where all 10 teams could come together once in a four-year graduation cycle. And I, as we saw today, the MAC is about academics and athletics. And I want to congratulate all the award winners for their great work, whether it be in the classroom or on the field of play. And it's really a, an astounding achievement. And when you see the numbers of athletes we have here who are doing so well in the classroom, I think it speaks well to our member institutions, our coaches, and athletic administrators on their focus that we both succeed on the field but also in the classroom. Because in the end, it's the classroom work that will lead to success in life. And we thank you for your hard work. <laughs> Finally, uh, because I never want to stay in between uh, an athlete and their dinner, I want to thank Fred Schuller from Disney Sports for coming out today and giving those warm remarks to us all. Fred is a great partner with us and Gail Brown and all the other Disney Sports people. We look forward to the continued relationship and as they rebrand themselves as ESPN uh, Wide World of Sports, we uh, look forward to some additional enhancements to the championship, whether it be broadcasting opportunities or just the whole look that they will bring to the rebranded park. So Fred, thank you and for all your hard work. And now let's uh, proceed outside and have a great dinner. Enjoy the ride. It's open for an hour and a half for the athletes. And for the parents, again, thank you for coming. Many of you ask us, but these, the pictures are available on the Max Sports uh, website, www.maxsports.com, if you're interested. Thank you.